What if you could travel back in time and prevent the tragic assassination of President John F. Kennedy in Dallas, Texas on November 22, 1963? That is the premise of Stephen King's fascinating television series, 11-22-63, available on Hulu and Amazon Prime. Our main character Jake Epping, played by actor James Franco, is an ordinary high school English teacher who stumbles upon a time portal, or rabbit hole as it's referred to in the show which catapults him back into the past, specifically the date of September 9, 1958. This isn't just a joyride through a bygone era of poodle skirts and soda shops though, Jake has a mission, to prevent the assassination of President John F. Kennedy on that fateful day in November 1963. The stakes are high and the rules of time travel are complex, adding layers of tension and suspense to the storyline. Time travel isn't a new concept in science fiction. From H.G. Wells' The Time Machine to Doctor Who, the idea of moving through time has captivated audiences for generations. But 112263 brings a fresh perspective to this well-trodden path, exploring not just the thrill of time travel, but also its potential consequences and moral implications. The show asks intriguing questions that keep us hooked. Can the past be changed? Should it be changed? And what happens if it is changed? These questions form the crux of the series, and as we follow Jake on his journey, we're invited to ponder these questions ourselves. Time travel in 112263 is more than just a plot device. It's a character in its own right, shaping the story and influencing the characters in profound ways. It's a tool for exploring themes of destiny, free will, and the complexity of human nature. Now hold on to your seats as we delve deeper into the mechanics of time travel in this captivating series. Imagine a pantry that serves as your gateway to the past. In 112263, it's called the rabbit hole. Now that's not your typical everyday pantry, is it? It's a portal to another era, a time machine tucked away behind canned goods and a mop bucket. But let's not get bogged down by the details. Instead, let's dive right in. In the world Stephen King creates, our protagonist, Jake Epping, discovers this peculiar portal, the rabbit hole, in the back of a local diner. It's not the kind of thing you expect to find next to the grilled cheese and fries, but then again, this isn't your average story. The rabbit hole, you see, is a time tunnel, a one-way ticket to the past, specifically the year 1960. Each time Jake steps through the rabbit hole, no matter when he does it in his present, he always arrives at exactly the same moment in the past, a sunny day in 1960. The world on the other hand is as real as the one he leaves behind. People, places, events, everything is exactly as it was over 60 years ago. Now this isn't a joyride, Jake isn't hopping back in time for a quick nostalgic trip. He's on a mission, a mission to change history. But we'll get to that later. For now, just imagine the possibilities, the freedom, the power. One step, and you're in another time. One step, and you're part of history. But remember, every action has its consequences. And in the world of 11-22-63, messing with time can have some serious repercussions. But we'll save that for another scene. The rabbit hole, an unassuming portal, sets the stage for a thrilling adventure through time. It's the start of a journey that will change Jake's life and the course of history forever. So buckle up, because we're just getting started. The past is waiting, and the future is up for grabs. Every game has rules, and time travel in 112263 is no exception. In Stephen King's universe, time travel isn't a free-for-all. There are stringent guidelines like the laws of physics which must be adhered to. The first rule is that each trip through the rabbit hole resets the timeline. Imagine it like a video game. Every time you restart, the game resets, and all your previous actions are wiped clean. Jake learns this the hard way when he tries to change the past on multiple occasions, only to find everything back to square one on his next journey. The second rule is that the past is pushing back. It means the past doesn't like to be changed. It resists, fights back, and often with a vengeance. It's like trying to swim upstream in a powerful river. The current, the past, makes any attempt to alter its course incredibly difficult. In 112263, this is seen through a series of unfortunate events that occur whenever Jake tries to change something significant. The third rule is the butterfly effect. This rule suggests that even the smallest action in the past can have significant effects on the future. It's named after the idea that the flapping of a butterfly's wings can cause a typhoon halfway across the world. In the context of the series, Jake's actions, no matter how minor, have unforeseen and often drastic consequences for his present day. 
These rules are not just plot devices, they serve to make time travel in the series more than just a amazing narrative tool. They give it weight and consequence, making Jake's mission not just a walk in the park but a challenging, perilous journey with real stakes. These rules not only guide Jake's journey but also add a layer of complexity to his mission. In 11.22.63 the past fights back, it's stubborn. The past in Stephen King's universe doesn't just sit back and let itself be altered. It pushes back, resists, and struggles. It's as if time itself has its own consciousness, its own will to preserve what has been. This is what we mean when we say the past is obdurate. Jake Epping quickly learns that time is a formidable opponent. He's not just battling against Lee Harvey Oswald or the clock ticking down to that fateful day in November. He's wrestling with the past itself and it's putting up a heck of a fight. The past throws obstacles in Jake's way at every turn. It's as if the universe conspires to prevent him from altering history. Cars break down at crucial moments. Accidents happen for no reason. People get hurt. It's like the past has its own immune system reacting to the foreign body that is Jake and his mission, trying to expel him or neutralize his effects. But what does this mean for Jake? It means his mission becomes a lot more than just a quest to change one event. It becomes a struggle against the forces of time itself, forces that don't want to be tampered with, that resist change. Every step he takes is met with resistance, every change he tries to make is countered with an equal and opposite reaction. This idea of the past being unchangeable adds a whole new layer of complexity to the story. It's not just about whether Jake can stop the assassination of JFK, it's about whether he can fight against the tide of time and win. Can he do what is impossible, change a past that doesn't want to be changed? This is what sets 112263 apart from other time travel narratives. It's not just a story about changing the past, it's a story about the past pushing back, about the past being a worthy adversary. The past's stubbornness to change adds an unexpected twist to Jake's mission, making his journey even more perilous. A single change in the past can drastically alter the future. This is the butterfly effect. This is a principle that is both captivating and terrifying, especially when we see it play out in Stephen King's 112263. Throughout the series the butterfly effect is a constant looming presence reminding us that even the smallest of actions can have monumental consequences. Take Jake Epping for instance, our time-traveling central character. Jake understands every action he takes in the past is like a pebble thrown into a pond, causing ripples that affect the course of history. For instance, when Jake saves a family from a tragic accident, he returns to his present only to find that his good deed has set off a chain of events leading to an entirely different and unforeseen outcome. The world he once knew is gone, replaced with a new reality shaped by his intervention. This is the essence of the butterfly effect, a theory first proposed by Edward Lorenz in the late 20th century. The name comes from the metaphorical example of a butterfly flapping its wings in Brazil causing a tornado in Texas. It's a dramatic illustration of how slight changes can lead to significant outcomes. In 112263, this concept is not just a theoretical principle but a tangible, life-altering reality for Jake. Every move he makes, every word he speaks, even his mere presence in the past, sets off a series of events that reshape his present. This constant uncertainty and the high stakes involved make Jake's mission not just a simple task but a perilous journey through a minefield of potential consequences. Every step he takes is a gamble, every decision is a roll of the dice. It's a game where the stakes couldn't be higher, the fate of a nation and the course of history itself. The butterfly effect serves as a constant reminder of the high stakes involved in Jake's mission. It reminds us that time travel is not just about the destination, but the journey and the ripples we leave behind. Time travel isn't without its paradoxes and 112263 showcases them brilliantly. Now, let's dive right into some of these mind-bending paradoxes. First up is the grandfather paradox, an age-old conundrum that asks, what happens if you travel back in time and eliminate your own grandfather before your father is born? This paradox is fascinating as it questions the very fabric of existence. In 112263, Jake Epping, the protagonist, grapples with this paradox as he attempts to change the past. Then there's the predestination paradox, which suggests that any actions taken by a time traveler were part of history all along. In other words, the past is fixed, and the time traveler's actions were always meant to happen, creating a closed loop of events. This paradox is evident in the series when Jake realizes that his actions may have been predestined, adding a layer of complexity to his mission. 
Another intriguing paradox presented is the bootstrap paradox, where an object or piece of information sent back in time becomes trapped within an infinite cause-effect loop. It exists without having been created. A nod to this paradox is seen when Jake encounters objects and events from the future that have influenced the past. Lastly, we have the paradox of change, where any attempt to alter the past creates a new timeline. This paradox is central to the plot of 112263, as Jake's actions in the past have unforeseen consequences for his present. Time travel in 112263 is far from a simple journey back and forth. It's a complex web of cause and effect, where every action has a reaction, and every decision, no matter how small, can ripple through time, creating waves of change. These paradoxes add a philosophical dimension to the series, making it a thought-provoking exploration of time travel. The journey through time leaves its mark, not just on history, but also on those who dare to traverse it. This couldn't be truer for the characters in Stephen King's 112263. Jake Epping is a prime example of how the past can change a man, for better or worse. Venturing into the world of the early 60s, Jake is initially a man out of time, struggling to adapt to a past that feels alien to him. But as he spends more time in this era, it starts to shape him. He becomes not just a visitor but a resident, embracing the culture, the lifestyle and even the fashion of the time. He's not just a man on a mission anymore, he's a man living a life. Yet, this journey isn't without its trials. The past as we've seen is unyielding. It resists change and it fights back. Jake experiences this firsthand. He faces constant obstacles, not just in his mission to prevent Kennedy's assassination, but also in his everyday life. And each struggle, each setback leaves a mark on him, shaping him into a stronger, more determined individual. But the impact of time travel isn't limited to Jake. Those around him are also affected by his journey. His love interest, Sadie for instance, is dramatically impacted by the knowledge of the future. It alters her perception of the world, and her place in it. She's forced to grapple with the reality that her life, her world, is just one version among countless possibilities. And then there are the others, the people Jake meets, the lives he touches. Each one is affected in some way, big or small, by his presence, by his actions. They're all threads in the tapestry of time and Jake's journey tugs at each one, altering the overall pattern. Time travel in 112263 is more than just a plot device. It's a character in its own right, shaping and reshaping those who interact with it. It's a force of nature, a force of history which leaves an indelible mark on those brave enough, or foolish enough, to dance with it. Time travel in 112263 is a complex, captivating exploration of the past, the future, and the very nature of time itself. We've delved into the rabbit hole, a portal that takes our protagonist, Jake Epping, back to a fixed point in time. A step into the unknown, a leap of faith into the past. From there we journeyed into the rules of time travel that govern this universe. Each trip resets the timeline, creating an erasure of past actions, and the past cannot be visited again without resetting everything. The past is obdurate, it doesn't want to be changed. We've seen the butterfly effect in action, how even the smallest change in the past can create a ripple effect that drastically alters the future. A dance with destiny, where every action has far-reaching consequences. We've also examined the paradoxes that time travel inevitably brings up. The complexities of interacting with your past self, the potential for changing events that would prevent you from time traveling in the first place, the philosophical questions about fate and free will. The effects of time travel on the characters in 112263 have been profound. We've seen how Jake's mission to prevent the assassination of John F. Kennedy has affected his relationships and his own sense of identity. The series presents a poignant exploration of the human condition, our struggle with choice, consequence, and the relentless march of time. Stephen King's 112263 offers us a unique approach to time travel, one that is deeply rooted in human experience and emotion. It's not just about the mechanics of moving through time but about how we as humans relate to our past, our future, and our place in the universe. And there we have it, a journey through time, exploring the intricate world of 112263. Thank you for joining Time Pilgrimage on this adventure, and if you like what you see, please select another of our videos, located on the upper right on your screen to view and enjoy. And as always, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to our channel for more captivating time and space-related content.